नेक्स्ट वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द केस ऑफ क्लोजिंग स्टॉक दिटेशन विल बी डिस्कस्ड इन टू केस रुस क्लोसी स्टॉकि डिस्क बै होंडिंग कंपनी टू दी सब्सिडरी कंपनी अब पार कंपनी सेलिंग टू सब्सिडरी कंपनी and and just the opposite subsidiary company is selling to parent company so let us see the both situation i will discuss first the sale by parent company to the subsidiary company so sale by parent company to the subsidiary company ऑलरेडी नवते सर होंडिंग कंपनी आई बय वि सब्सिडरी कंपनी अब वि कैन टेक एन एक्सापि होंडिंग कंपनी ट्रांसफर गुड्स टू सब्सिडरी कंपनी ओके गुड्स कहनेवेशन असटल ट्रांसफर गुड्स असूम नमु Goods worth rupees forty thousand. Forty thousand rupees value of the goods are not transferred. So, that is the goods in the end the cost price under the value. And it has been transferred at rupees fifty thousand. In other words, we are talking sale in the case of selling price under the value fifty thousand. So, what is the element of profit? क्वेश्चन रिमेनि That is held as stock. It is being held as stock in the subsidiary company. Subsidiary company is not a stock. I did not. That is the situation. So this profit on twenty five percent of the goods. E stock I did not goods in the. 25 percent is good center profit. That is the unrealized profit in this situation. Karnam, our good center is not only sale. It is only profit realized. It is only subsidiary company. It is only that the rest of the goods are not good. So we cannot. In the matter profit is good, but it is not sold. So that profit on 25 percent is on the good sold. Is the unrealized profit. So in the situation, the unrealized profit of uh, unrealized profit of seller are not there. Because the seller is the example of a holding company. So how we will deal that? I think every day, our accounting treatment, I think every day, our adjustment is changing. This element of unrealized profit, I mean, what is it? It is the amount of goods in the unrealized profit. एंडल वरान बाढ़ नहीं ला वाइल यू प्रिपेयर द कंसोलिडेटेड बैलेंस शीट अलग ही कंसोलिडेटेड फिनैंशियल स्टेटमेंट प्रिपेयर आई हूँ आदिल वरान बाढ़ नहीं ला शुड नॉट रिफ्लेक्ट अदर नाना नमली एडजस्टमेंट इतने डिटेल लोड बढ़ी की व्हाट वी विल डू सो द प्रॉफिट ऑफ प्रॉफिट ऑन द 25 परसेंटेज ऑफ गुड्स सोल्ड बाय द हेल्ड होल्डिंग कंपनी शु 
eliminated while you prepare the consolidated balance sheet. So balance sheet le where you will adjust. This is a particular adjustment where you will deal. So this profit on 25 percentage. 25 percentage goods becomes the unrealized profit. Sadhana so, profit related transactions every day and adjust another and the unrealized profit adjust here. That means balance sheet surplus. Alangle P and the profit and loss balance on the trend and element in the end deduct here, unrealized profit deduct here. This is the first case. That is, you have to deduct the unrealized profit from the surplus or the profit given. P and L or surplus given in the liability side, other the profit I can have plus a surplus etreano, other than you have to detect the unrealized profit. I am going to find out here while we do the problem, we will discuss. So, this is about the first case that is sale by parent company or the holding company to the subsidiary company. The second case, sale by subsidiary to parent. There is a subsidiary company and a parent company. We are holding a money like goods to sell in a situation. Every day, just like the previous example, 40,000 value or la goods are not going to be able to transfer. That is the cost price. Then, Actual other sell is the price 50,000 selling price. So the profit would be 10,000. Total profit in the value on a 10,000. In the case of the stock, we will remind you of the stock. That is the portion of the stock. We will calculate it. Okay, that is the problem. We will do it in detail. So, E10,000 or in the Mujo and stock in the profit. Kind of example number another angle. So, every day we can make an assumption that subsidiary company is the seller here, and holding company is the buyer. So, holding company wang it to where they make a leg with, sir. They are also selling it to customers. So, every day we can make an assumption as 75 percentage. Goods sold. So, what is remaining? The remaining is 25 percentage. Remains as stock. So, E25 percentage stock like unrealized profit in the question we remove. Idam Arida Bukala no kinda consolidated balance sheet to prepare in bo e parayana unrealized profit of paramarila. So in this case, but the situation you have to make. 
adjustment in the book of buyer as well as the seller. Okay. In the case of buyer, buyer in the books, in the books of buyer. Buyer in the books, when you record the amount of closing stock, a closing stock amount in the varambadilla, profit element varambadilla. So closing stock in the value, buyer in the books, other the holding company and the holding company in the books. When you record the amount of closing stock, you have to deduct unrealized profit. Other than them, deduct it to be recording. Closing stock in one unrealized profit deduct here. The holding company is any seller, the situation of seller. So then how will you prepare the books of seller? Allegal at the case like subsidiary company. This subsidiary company at a case in the Nokumba Sadhikandaya. Ipo e transfer, allegal goods transfer either another. Pre-acquisition period ilano, post-acquisition period ilano, and the mokki to anam jiya. And the ordinary ningal, if it, if the transfer happens during pre-acquisition period, pre-acquisition samaya thana naram dirikki ningil, ningal e unrealized profit or deducted in the pre-acquisition profit il nindana. If the transaction happen in the post-acquisition period, post-acquisition period ilana, e goods transfer e dirikki ningil, you have to deduct that unrealized profit from post acquisition profit maybe question the, the they might ha, not have specified the uh, date date parnittilla nu vicharikya how will you treat the same uh, the question is silent about the date so if the question is silent about the date of transfer you will assume it as post acquisition period you may write down that note also. If the question is silent about the date of transfer, assume the date of sale in the post acquisition period. So, this is when goods, that is stock in the situation, closing stock, that is goods is being transferred between holding company and subsidiary company. Our end situation, we will end it discuss it. Our situation, unrealized profit, where books of accounts are adjusting. The next video, we will discuss a problem.